Hey YouTube, how you guys doing today? Cisco Soldier, check it out. Appreciate y'all coming back. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Now today we're here to talk about the Microsoft Azure Fundamentals Exam AZ900. Right? I just recently took this test, passed it in about eight days. So I'm gonna hook you up, guys, up with some tips and tricks to ensure that you can do the same thing. Right? It all depends on your previous knowledge of the cloud, but hey, we'll get through it. All right? So let's go ahead and go under the hood. Let's get started. Let's talk about these resources. All right. So come here, right? You know, you go to Microsoft.com, go to Docs, all right, and it tells you everything you need to know about the Azure uh, Fundamental Exam for AZ900, okay? And then basically, you know, what Microsoft would like to know is like, hey, at least before sitting for this exam, you do have some type of fundamental knowledge on cloud services, all right? These are the skills that you will be measured on, right? The cloud concepts, Azure core services, core solutions, management tools, security, governance, cost management, and service level agreements, right? Now. When you come over here, right, what I would suggest to everybody, right, uh, before you get started, what I would definitely always suggest to people is that, you know, as you're studying, you need to get a little bit of hands-on knowledge as well, okay? So what you do is you go to Azure, right? You go to Microsoft Azure and you can create an actual free account, right? You can create a free account with these guys and that way you can start practicing some stuff. That way you can actually see what's going on as you're studying for the exam, okay? So you can actually go to the Azure portal, right? And then, you know, it, it'll show you how to create services and stuff. So that way, as you're studying and you're seeing what's going on, you can actually do a little bit of the study material that you're learning, right? Now, what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna share with you just a couple paid resources that you can use, right? Like Uncle Trey, I, I, I like to use paid resources, you know, for the most part. Um, sometimes, just for me personally, sometimes I feel like it's a little bit more structured and I don't have to go searching around for bits and pieces of information. So that why, that's why, you know, I kinda like to use structured courses for the most part, but you know, I'm gonna give you guys some free resources too. But like, as far as the structured courses, right? Like this is what I use, so I come over to Udemy, right? And then you know, you can get his course. It's a guy, his name is uh, Scott Duffy, right? Had a very, very good course. You know, it's structured, you know, it's uh, so many hours, you know, you go through that. It's not long at all. You know, you just go through. I think it took about like, since about five hours, right? It has a practice test that comes with it. Only costs about 10 bucks, you know, pretty good resource. But this is what I use to go through just so I can get a, a good understanding of what's going on. I also went to Wiz Labs, right? Wiz Labs is a very, very good uh, source when it comes to like studying for cloud courses, right? And they also have um, practice. They also have practice tests, and they have a lot of videos and stuff that go with it. You can also get some hands-on labs, right? So this is very good as well. Now, for the free side of things, right? I'm gonna leave a link in the description, right? You can come here. To the, I'm gonna leave the link to this uh, website right here. And this right here will give you a free set of practice questions that will help you after you finish studying, right? These will help you, you know, kind of hone in your skills, you know, tighten up your shot group, like they say in the military. And that way you can get some practice before sitting for the real exam, all right? So I'm gonna leave this link in the description. Hey, so you can go to YouTube, right, and type in AZ900 Playlist, right? And it's gonna come up with a bunch of free videos from YouTube that you can use to study. What I personally recommend for everybody, okay, where it says right here, Free Code Camp, the guys from Exam Pro, this is a very, very good course, about three hours long, tells you pretty much everything you need to know. I also recommend, you know, uh, right here where it says Inside Cloud Security, they have a very good course as well. Hey, so overall, it definitely really wasn't a hard exam at all. Like I say, it took me about eight days. Uh, I think I started on the 26th of December and I finished around the 2nd of January. I finished on the 2nd of January, okay? Um, definitely doable. Nothing uh, any of you guys can't do, all right? So just make sure, like I say, if you're starting out on your Azure journey, once again, I do recommend that you go sign up for the Azure free account and play around in the portal a little bit, all right? Other than that, if anybody has any questions, just leave them in the comment section. It was I Says Me, Cisco Soldier, aka Uncle Trey. Appreciate y'all for stopping by. Thank you. Thank you.